Congrats on a pretty crazy match. What are your thoughts on that? Yeah, tough. Um, yeah, d difficult game. You know, we went a goal down and, um, you know, we had to come back, which we did. Uh, and then, you know, the last part was obviously, you know, Perth got the equaliser and, you know, we uh, still found a way to get a goal in the last couple of minutes, which is, you know, credit to the players. What were your thoughts when Glory went down and then obviously most outsiders would think, OK, well, it's uh, look. You you got to stay calm um, because you know if you get caught up in the moment, you know we've got one extra is uh, when you can get caught on the break, and that was still dangerous on the break. You know, um, Taggart's in great form, and you can see it. You know, every time there was a through ball, there was a few that were offside, but you know, you, you, he he makes he makes things happen. So um, yeah, that's something that he has and. Uh, but look, I thought we had good control. Um, yeah, they defended very well. It wasn't easy. Keeper made some good saves. Um, you know, and in the end, I thought you know we uh, we got a good win. And away from home is difficult. I know how tough it is here from coaching here. How tough it is for teams to come. And a couple of weeks ago, Perth came back to win three two. And um, you know, this time we did it. So very happy. Can you talk us through your emotions when it went to all and then three two? I think at two two, I think I was a bit disappointed because I, th I thought at two one we we dropped off, uh, we started giving the ball away, we started playing the time, um, which was a bit. I, I'd say from the uh, send off, that's probably the the only disappointing part I had was at two one, uh, we gave the ball away, we got sloppy, we gave corner after corner away, uh, which is very unnecessary, uh, and in the end, you know. The amount of times the ball comes in, you know, someone can make an error or someone gets a good touch on the ball and you concede. But I always felt that we would get another opportunity. It was just whether we, we could take it. And, uh, you know, Benny scored a fantastic winner. And what were you feeling when Benny scored that? Yeah, obviously we're, we're delighted, you know, and, um, you know, we've we scored three goals away from home. We've, you know, our run continues. Um, you know, we're still undefeated and, you know, the, the character the players are showing is, um, you know, we're very proud of the way they played. Um, you know, we had a lot of adversity this week. We had a lot of joy this week as well. So we've had a lot of players that have been sick throughout the whole week. So we had to come through a, a fair bit. Um, you know, Connor and his partner had their first child. So there was something, um, you know, for him was difficult this week, you know, in terms of sleeping and... Whether he was going to come or not was touch and go. Um, thought he had a great game, and um, so you know we'll, we'll celebrate a bit tonight for for Connor and his, you know, his baby girl, his first child. So uh, you know, a lot of a lot of things have happened this week, and you know we we're happy. We'll recover well from a difficult trip and um, go again. You mentioned a bit of sickness in the group. How many players? Ah, oh, look, it's, it's gone through everyone throughout the whole week, and. Um, and yeah, it's probably the last trip you want is to come to Perth when when, a few, when players are down throughout the whole week. But look, we didn't mention it through the week. I can mention it now after the game. But uh, you know, obviously through the week, uh, the players were just we were looking after every every player that we had to and made sure that they just got through the week without doing too much and come here and just put on a performance and uh, and, and get a win any way we can and. Um, you know, Perth were, were very good and very resilient, so uh, we're happy. And given those challenges, does it make it extra satisfying the results tonight? Yeah, I, th I think yeah, any result here, I would have been satisfied. Um, you know, obviously, when Bruce got sent off, um, you know, you, you want to get the win, but you don't want to throw the game away either. Um, so, yeah, like I said, 2-1 a, a was, was the part that I wasn't happy about. Uh, and then at 2-2... Two, two, we took the ascendancy again. So that's an area it just shows we've still got to grow. We, we, we've got to improve and uh, we've got to do better in those situations. Tony, how do you think uh, you were about for a four role where it looked like Zinedine kind of stepped up as that sort of performance, particularly in the first half of the game, was a bit more open? We scored three goals. So we won. We're happy. Um, I know there's a lot of, there is a lot of focus and, and I understand the questions about Bruno, but at, at any moment, a player can get injured, suspended, and you're without a player. And uh, yeah, I'd rather talk more about the players that came in. You know, we got young Eli Adams scored a wonderful goal. Benny scored 
Nishan had opportunities. They're all young players. Jordi Valadon comes back after three months out with an injury. Um, yeah, the, the, foc the focus shouldn't be on Bruno. The focus should be on Bruno now when we go watch against Bahrain and hopefully he plays. Um, but, you know, we're, we're, we're happy with the win and uh, the players that played should get the credit.